Hello friend, welcome back to Toyota Maintenance YouTube channel. 2005 Toyota Tacoma with 160,000 miles. I showed you in different videos, for example, it was about this heavy body armor, which is right here. And it gives me today a lot of opportunities to show you maintenance items. What I always do in detail inspection, I check front brakes and I have to <clears throat> check the rear brakes. It's a drum brakes, so you don't have a brake pads. So you start with removing the wheel, then you find out that the drum is stuck, doesn't want to go off. So you bring your special bolts which will basically push it away from that hub. We review this in different video on this channel. So if you want to see more about this and how it's used, just find it on the, this channel. And I want to show you something again, which is unusual. And I don't see it every day. These drums, these drum brakes are full of that dangerous toxic dust. So you always start with a nice brake cleaner. This one is from my supplier O'Reilly. Have a garbage can underneath it and I will start with cleaning it. Observe the dust, it's crazy. You see it underneath? being pushed on the side you don't want to be breathing that stuff if you do and you do a lot of breaks that will probably kill you within a year who knows it's a toxic so you always want to clean it for yourself also for the owner of the vehicle that should be enough considering that I'm doing only inspection I installed the light there and I want to show you that these brake shoes are extremely thin. So the one on the front ends up always thinner. So in the back, what you will say we see. This is the brake shoe. Here we have those gauges, helpful to explain and show to the customers. The smallest one, it's two millimeter, the gauge. So I think the shoe in the back is 3 mm. Let's move on the front. And you guys know from my videos, that front is always the reason why we are doing these jobs, why we are replacing the shoes. It's always this spot. It's thinnest. In the back you can have four and you will have two or less on the front. This one is actually thinner than that two millimeter gauge. If you look at it, it's like one and a half or one millimeter. This is very close to breaking, falling apart. Then while the person will be breaking, you see this toxic dust, which immediately fell out of it when I removed the drum. Also remaining here, this will all be vacuumed and cleaned. So you are risking that you will destroy inside of the drum if this breaks and it's so thin that I want to show it to you once again the smallest gauge two millimeter it's too big for it and both of them are in red that that's visual for customers to show them hey it's time to do it so I will snap picture also for the customer this customer show it hey this repair I will actually recommend ASAP video so I hope you find it useful helpful interesting and be subscribed I have way more coming your way soon thanks for watching and have a great day my friend